interesting. It looks a lot brighter than last time. It's because it's connected to the car and not a 9 volt battery. I'll show you what I did. I connected it to the left headlight. Right now I'm going to turn off the car. I'm going to open the hood. As you can see it turned off. Let's get some light in here. As you can tell from last time, the wire is running. But I managed to curve the wire into the, the headlight. And I managed to temporarily connect the wires from the logo to my left Exxon light. And here are two pictures, or probably one picture, on how and where I connected it. Now that you've seen those two pictures, it's time to turn on the car. got an idea of how it is so my car is already back home and I don't have to worry about turning my turn signal on to the left or the right and the emblem will not turn off because I think I connected it to the right area and my car is also back home so I don't think it'll make a difference let's turn the turn signal not liking about it is this when you put it into a parking uh, lights we turn on wait how did I say parking? the parking lights these are my parking lights I can't get the logo to turn on maybe it's the connection but I don't care it would look really nice if the logo would be on but it's fine I'm not gonna mess with it I'm just gonna try to organize the cables in there cable management and wire yeah just stay tuned for Thursday as I will be dynoing my car. Also, forgot to mention, I bought some Tron reflective lights. I'm gonna actually show you how cool it really looks. I'm gonna close my garage, turn off the car. And then let's get some light. It's pretty cool. Let me see if I can get a better angle. Stupid garage light. Won't turn off. It's white. And it's going to look really nice in the dark. But for now, I'm just going to try to figure out a good area to have it.